what more can I say? What more can I say at this point? It's a child that was paid to do spell work on my business. Mm -hmm. They're having to go to court. They're threatening to lock them up if the mom or whoever that feminine caregiver that accepted the money on that on that child's behalf. Somebody accepted the money on this child's behalf to attack my channel. The family knows that child is going to be taken, I guess, to one of them type of delinquent facilities. But, I mean, they stole from <laughs> my channel, so, and others. Think about this. It's a boy, Earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Now, spiritually, everybody know who that boy had been talking to. The 19-year-old boy, not this child. He has spiritual court today, though. Um, if you're impacted by that. It's some low vibrational salesmen. Connected to different tarot card readers. All of the tarot card readers are low vibrational. Ain't none of the tarot card readers that I'm uh, talking about, referring to, even without saying names. They are not divine feminines. None of them. They're not even healers, okay? At some point in time, their inner child were healers. But they allowed their inner child to get wrapped up in different situations involving... Chinese directors, low vibrational librarians, and then some hoes that was doing a lot of things. We just go call them prostitutes from Indiana. All of them, all of them, all of them. We're not leaving none out. These are all karmic females that will come to your mind. <laughs> Honesty is the best policy. I got taught that religiously and spiritually. It's a whole lot of money in this motherfucker. If you know my business and you broke, then just shut up. Is what that song said. Mm -mm. What about the uh, prison Minnesota energy? What the collective need to know? There they are. They're surrounded. By who? They can't describe it. They don't know. They just know they're surrounded. <laughs> well, that didn't make that was that one for them. That's why they, um, mm, yeah, no. So, the people, the groups of people, the community of uh, people within a pr Minnesota prison, one half of the group, one half of the group is going in a different direction. The other half of the group is going somewhere else. They're going to the light. Mm. Look into the light, Carolyn. Look into the light. Oh, don't worry. It's just a matter of time before I get to those um, Chinese men that were doing deliberate mind control spells through TV network broadcasting stations. And was passing the money down for the last at least 500 years, 5,000 to some other Knight of Pentacles warriors watching. Yep, for 5,000 years. They go to Five of Wands right there with the Ten of Wands. She said what she said, it's 5,000.
Okay, so that was one message. I have another message to a child. They said, do not say they are baby. But after a certain a years, I just say, I say baby. You little baby. It's, you, that's, this baby took out, so, took such and such out into the water. If you know, then you know. This baby is responsible for getting that um, artist. That artist that was uh, connected to milit military Navy people stationed in Alaska doing different things. I was going to come there too. I ain't mind the call. They heard that. Y'all considering her coming to Alaska? They shouldn't have been scared thinking that they were losing something by me earning opportunities. Right. That was weird. Mm. That was weird. Well, to those individuals or anybody connected to those type of people, low vibrational directors, the people that use electronics for mind control and manipulation for low vibrational purposes, and prostitutes from Indiana that y'all posing as librarians in uh, Wisconsin, yeah. It's some money in that, in that Minnesota prison. If my name on it, take it. The fuck? I would like it to be released to me. Where they do that at? <laughs> Why can't I accept money? What they're saying is boils down to being low vibrational and karmic at the end of the day. The young man there said he knows who his father is. I mean, y'all been watching him for the last however long, seven months at least, since the death of somebody else. Mm -mm. No, nah, he not speaking to y'all. I thought I said that already. They didn't understand. Well, that... That's, they don't understand logic. I said that. <laughs> I said that already yesterday. They shouldn't even be watching me. <laughs> so to that baby watching, I'm going to do a um, light worker's message for all 12 signs. So you just pick your north node the one that you like okay this is for me for your healing and ascension the dispatcher's communication station wanted this round up they earned it after a long time after a lot of chaos after a lot of just trauma bad bad things right now that they know better, they are going to do better. Whoopings from God always hurt, but it's worth it because it's a whooping from God. It's tarot card readers connected to Jamel because Jamel's bloodline is from South Carolina. And they don't watch YouTube. They don't even know about my YouTube, my YouTube station or my actual channel. It's some karmic female tarot card readers connected to my husband. <laughs> you ladies pissed off the people in Nevada's dispatcher's communication station because. Look at, the, look at all the deaths of these different men, and I'm about to tell you. The, the Nevada Dispatcher's Communication Station 
started losing AAA insurance employees, Microsoft Systems employees, um, truck drivers that independently trail different objects, services, provide whatever, whoop -de -whoop, and the men who take calls to unlock doors. So, right, them last two, y'all, y'all, them the ones that y'all really, y'all already, um, them karmic masculines. They were stealing from y'all. You get it? <laughs> okay. They do now. That's good. Once you know better, you do better. So divine masculines. Yeah, I said it. <laughs> right. Divine masculine. In the spiritual realm, everybody knows what you and divine feminine are doing. In different dimensions, everybody knows what's going on. The devil is collecting by blood, not money. So, motherfucker, this ain't no... Oh, that's what they thinking. They thinking it's like that Avatar shit where they going looking for Jake Sully. <laughs> that's how y'all karmic feminines thinking, y'all. <laughs> that's how they looking at it. Mind you, they looking at it from a confused bipolar perspective, right? <laughs> I'm not laughing at them. I had to survive that, y'all. I had to survive it. I had to survive it and thrive during it. Divine masculine, if I could do it, I know you could do it. But yeah, so you don't realize the lowest vibrational reflection of yourself in a woman form is somebody that you really consider caring about. It's not a soulmate. You realizing it's ties and it's not a soul tie either. All that shit is bullshit, right? It's not that. Archangel Michael, you feel like he be too busy for you sometimes. I mean, shit, you, you think about what the fuck you doing who you are, what you're supposed to be doing. When you feel like that, that means you in a in the Five of Cups and Seven of Swords being sneaky, pretending like you're not hurt, pretending like you're not experiencing the feeling, emotion of loss and grief. That ain't healthy. That ain't happy. That ain't healthy. That's not helping. You feeling grief from the karmics. That one lowest vibrational person that you see as yourself. That's not divine feminine. That's karmic. That's not your person. You get it? Mm-hmm. That hoe about to go through some changes. I'm sorry for calling her a hoe. She cannot be protected. So if anything, you know how they like playing with John Wick? If they see her and they know it don't matter if she's here or not and she really is like needing to be gone and removed, then that's what's going to happen. The karmics felt the same way about your divine feminine. And I mean, like, the folks that you used to go to war for. The folks that you really just, you know what I'm saying? You used to speak to. The people that you used to speak to. Them the ones your ancestors is accepting change for. All right? The ones that was on the sun. Not Mars. All right? This person has a moon in Aries. Well, I mean, yeah, it's a lot of... Okay, so remember I put it on my community board. How many moons does Jupiter really have? I, like, I don't have to be out here um, talking to complete strangers about what's in my blood and what I'm doing. <laughs> that's weird. I ain't no motherfucking bot. That's what... That's So bots from Twitter... Bots from Twitter. You all are about to get rounded up. It's bots from Twitter connected to uh, that moon in Aries, lowest feminine reflection of yourself. That could be a man or a woman. It ain't a both no more because the women are done. The ones that would be like women, look like women, they done. You could tell it's not a woman or a man, okay? 
it's about to be some changes for these different type of people. And Divine Masculine, y'all be around all these people or in communication with someone that's in communication with them, but that's really them working through that person. Let's start with Indiana. There could be an Indian judge or a judge in the state of Indiana. Take it how it resonates for you because I, I do talk international. These females are connected to that young man that's underage and was getting paid to use his mercury energy for low vibrational ways. Okay? So once this occurred, this occurred. Ancestors showed up. Ancestors are in money. I said that already. <laughs> Then they teach us money grew from trees or they were cut. I learned in school paper came from trees in general. Mm -hmm, right. They forgot what they had taught us. So when they realized, oh, shit, it was some woke ones early on. They start trying to knock some of them off. But luckily, majority of them was karmics. So it was like a, well, what's it with boom, boom, wham, wham. <laughs> Shazam. <laughs> Oh, that's where he got that from. Oh, okay. All right. I'm sorry, Divine Masculine. Let me get back to the, the Indian judge, the judge in Indiana. That whole knee rounded up. <laughs> right. <laughs> when it comes to some prostitutes, you have to tell all of them they they are going to have to make a plan of changing what they how they're prostituting and what they're prostituting, by the way, both. So some of you need to tell, talk to some prostitutes and let them know it's about to be extreme changes, even movement. So they have to start making a plan because they're going to be removed. You understand? Okay. That is no longer going to be an occupation on planet Earth. Prostitution is no longer an occupation on planet Earth. The fuck? If they pay taxes, that's still... Think about what is taxes. Oh, okay, right. So I'm going to keep going. There are some librarian karmics. These librarian karmics are known to be isolated and alone, sad and depressed, and some of them have gotten fired recently. They are single and alone, but come off as having sudden wealth. It's not materialistic. It's energetically based. They're spiritual prostitutes and work through different bodies on planet earth and objects from what i'm hearing with this toil and labor yeah they be going hard with things okay and that's not sexually i meant mentally psychologically <sighs> anybody with a sex addiction and you still on planet earth if you don't get that shit handled and under control and go really seek help therapy then your asses go end up very very heartbroken Light workers are high vibrational practitioners, by the way. I don't think any of them are going to be doing tarot card readings on social media at all or offering to do it out of their home. They're just going to be people you come across and they're going to start speaking some truth to you. And to you, it's not going to feel they're a psychic. It's going to feel like how it feels when you're watching TV and you want to binge watch. You're going to want to binge listen to what this person has to say. All right. So to the international Chinamen who have realized they've been fucked over by karmics, men and women and aliens of sorts, you all are now um, just in your own apathetic energy. This is where you all are, okay? Now that you know that, go ahead and express communication to whatever financial services, and or institutions that you all need to speak with to get, um, it's, it's, uh, y'all know what to what, all right? I'm looking at a dime, um, that was made in 1990, 1990, mm-hmm, yeah, what it say on the back of this dime? E pluri usuno. And then I got a penny, this is a newer penny, 2016. 
and God we trust where Abraham Lincoln is always been upside down. He pluribus unum. One cent with that ugly ass flag in the back. Is this a crown on the back of the uh, thing? No, it's two uh, little tree things and a torch that the lady be holding. Two plants, excuse me. Two plants next to the torch that Lady Liberty holds. Y'all remember when everybody was like, start collecting your change, kids? And they even start making the things where you collect in different year quarters. <laughs> uh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh, yeah, if you a kid getting bullied in school, put a bag of quarters or change, nickels, dimes, just a bag of change and a sock and keep it in your backpack. Trust me, if they, if these other children out here got time to pull out guns from backpacks, you pull out a, a sock full of change and just start whooping ass with that sock full of change. I'm a mother of six. I got permission to tell who I'm telling to do that to. It's like y'all thought this was bullying. Nah, they ain't even bullying no more. It's little karmic ass children in school with divine feminines. They don't want to talk about that though. They don't want to talk about that, though. Divine masculine. Y'all haven't done anything to the divine feminines. Y'all were... It's only a couple that I'm talking to. But y'all have 15 low vibrational karmic females that's been gang stalking me for the last nine years. So you get confused sometimes. That's okay. It's like when you're watching TV and boom, you're ready to change the channel. You find something... Then boom, you ready to change channel again. God say, you know, that's the truth. <laughs> you can ignore anything and be watching a certain show. Grown men used to be able to ignore people and play the game, but then they introduced them headphones. And you got some people out here just extra psychic and they sleep with headphones on. Sometimes something might be playing, sometimes it don't. I don't even want to talk about these low vibrational ass karmic females. But y'all need to know. Because all y'all directors is being read by that same principality of the karmic female. Okay? Every director. Anybody that call themselves a director. See, ain't that what look like a little trophy thing for the movie things and stuff? All of them. This ain't it. Over exaggerated. <laughs> Washed up. They smell good because they use good soap. But guess what that soap is made from? Right. Right. You see it now? Okay. Shit getting real in that field. I hear you, husband. That's where you at? That's where that's at? No. I know, right? <laughs> uh, Ludacris, the rapper. And his name, Christopher. Love is different. Tell him again, my baby. Sometimes I want to be your lover. Sometimes I want to be your friend. Play fight. Hold hands. Just cuddle. But then, them jealous, that jealous-ass principality. Just send the devil walking by in a red dress. And I know it's the devil, but I'll be like, shit, I could pass this test. What y'all need to know about it as y'all are making changes. Clearing out your astral waters. Okay with secrets being communicated. As long as it's truth and it brings balance, that's the higher philosophy. Honesty is the best policy. It's been an ending for deception and disgrace being just, okay, nah. That's what the devil wanted, but it's balance here on planet Earth now, okay? Oh, 
Mercury, on this good Sunday, please use the sun's energy to channel the most high vibrational, uh, nah, that ain't what that was. Well, who said that? I hate when people talk when I'm talking and I'll be serious and like actually talking. In class, if the teacher asks you to read, a motherfucker's talking while you read and you just kind of get him a look like, see, that's why you don't know how to read. You too busy talking. Not rapping, not mapping, not clapping. Talking. Running your lips. Gums. It's the men that do that a lot. And don't be talking about shit. I am a hermit, but I always spoke my mind. That's why the boys like me in secret. They like shit. She's smart. She got a mouth, too. But not in a sexual way. Oh, then that's when them rumors came up. I will. I don't give a fuck. I went out there in competition. That was a girl. <laughs> right. <laughs> she ain't got no throne. She has thorns. Oh, well. The biggest change that divine masculines need to make for their healing and ascension right now is releasing guilt. And stop feeling guilty about releasing evil as queens. They are salt, not sugar. And your affirmation says you deserve salt, not sugar. This affirmation isn't for evil queens. The moment they try to use this as an affirmation to themselves, not even looking at themselves in the mirror, it's not going to be a nice, serene burning of release of guilt for them. It's not. It's going to be something totally different. You're not going to have to worry about it because you've already cut that off. Right? You already go cut that witch off. That evil queen. Evil queen, witch, bitch. Trot box thought socks <laughs> beady beady bop bop <laughs> a beady beady bop I know right how's that for a happily ever after fake ginger heads are feeling some type of way right now some girls with locks in their hair about to cut their hair and start wearing orange colored lace fronts some of them may be green. Any female with green in their locks right now, stand up for yourself, bitch. I don't have green in my locks, but somebody's done something and I'm it's somewhere where it looks like I have green locks, so <laughs> divine masculines, you guys are taming your ego, right? You're in your emperor, high priest mode, 24 hours out the day, right? That is what matters. You are going to make a change. Yeah, when that song came on, I was like, oh, yeah. Going to make a change. It's going to feel good. Oh, yeah. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I don't know how some of those uh, children's childhood was. I do know how I would like children's childhood to be moving forward in the long run. Queen of Swords and the Four of Swords just spit out. Y'all are going to have to ignore those bitches right now. Okay? Ignore them, please. That's the first change y'all need to make. Why do y'all answer for these hoes? I seen Justina, a video on YouTube of her just calling the different people from fucking wildin' out, right? Yeah, y'all saw that shit too, huh? I just watched it to watch it because I was wondering why they even answering the phone. Well, it's bitches like her that's actually about to be getting ignored. That's, that's the first change that y'all should know. That's the first secret that y'all should know. Ignore these bitches. If you don't ignore them, um, something real bad gonna happen to you. You don't have to visualize bad things happening to them because you still have to reap your own harvest of what you sow. You can just visualize yourself ignoring them, them disappearing, dissipating, and see positive things for yourself. Okay? So back to this your inner child used to know what to do. 
Your inner child was real good at being sneaky, not being a liar. You you put yourself in a situation where before you lie, you're not going to say nothing. So you moved in ways that made you happy. Moved in ways that made your dad happy. Moved in ways that made your cousin happy. Then once niggas started getting incarcerated the way for like new beginnings, some of y'all was like, no. And some said, all right, they do it in churches. Okay. That's an illusion that's about to be destroyed. Just know the root worker practitioner hoes and bitches, all they nephews, all they sons, all they side piece niggas, all them, all them niggas are done. All right? It don't matter where they are. You don't have to be on the game to think that you talking to them type shit for real. Some of y'all need to unplug that game for like five weeks. Detox. If you are uh if you were a school bully and you now feel sad cuz that truth has been exposed and you just bullied people cuz you had inner issues and it wasn't even with a bad bitch it was just you didn't understand karma you were looking into laws of other things not universal laws not you know past the What's it called? Like a worthless victory. Clout. That's what it is. A worthless victory. That's the definition of clout for some motherfuckers that need to know. The definition of clout is worthless victory. Yeah, make note of that moving forward. Ghost the clout chasers. Ghost the ones that say they do anything for clout. Especially on social media. What are you missing if you were to just get off social media? Like, delete, not deactivate. Delete and let it stay deleted for the 30-day limit or whatever the fuck. What's the worst that could happen? I'm talking to divine masculine. I'm talking to earth angels. Not niggas protecting the low vibrational karmic tarot card readers and bitches and business owners and librarians and lying, cheating, the low vibrational soulmates that they do magic with and on and for each other. It's going to be some changes to how some, to some industries. It's going to be happy, positive changes to some industries. Divine masculine. Y'all know all that. Y'all, shit, y'all know spell work. Yeah. Release, ignore. Projections, responsibilities, and burdens from exes, from bitter bitches, from fake bitches. I will hold it in reverse, but why? I'm telling you, you see it. Exactly. Hoes that try to pretend like they can look like me. That was a worthless victory, huh? Divine Masculine, y'all know them, them karmics did moon magic recently, right? For some of you, the karmic is your mother. Some of you are going to have to ignore her. You're not her husband. You're her child. You are her husband's DNA but that was her this this the husband in the spiritual realm you see that he has the castle behind him she out here by the water the, the leaves are different they're not in the same garden they're not in the same field
That's because your mother wasn't an empress. Your father may have been an emperor, but your mother wasn't an empress. So you as her son, unfortunately, her manipulative ass took every cup you were giving her in your empathetic, balanced, emotionally available energy to help be a support system. They went and took every wand, every letter you gave them and transformed it into money. Transformed it into years down the line of Empress in Reverse energy. They tried to anyway. They sad now because they like <laughs> that worthless victory is coming back to kick them in the ass. That's what you need to know. What I just said. You stay um, ghost the niggas in all dimension and reality. You ghost their ass. Mm -hmm. All of them. All of them. All of them. Masculine and feminine energies. All of them. Yeah, y'all discernment is on now. Yeah, y'all can see the difference when you're thinking in that hangman energy. you like, fuck, I'm in the five of pentacles. But when I'm in the full card, when I'm in the full card, that's who lied. That's who cheated. That's who stole. That's who did such and such. That's Y'all be having y'all own tea of swords. At least y'all be giving it to y'all feminine ancestors if you didn't know. And they were taking it like, uh-uh. We like how this spell work is being transformed. Where we at? Who, who's doing this? Who's doing this? Our descendant from... Our descendant from where? He's supposed to be doing what? And the lady that gave birth to him did what? <laughs> For what? <laughs> y'all playing, right? Nah, tell me y'all tell me y'all lying. This ain't no joke. What? Yeah. Mm mm. That's why they stressed and burden. Y'all feminine ancestors that played with them white hoes is stressed and burden allow real high priestesses to be stolen from yeah truth hurts oh well them hoes about to burn on the sun finally mm -hmm. just teleporting as a sport wasn't she that hoe was teleporting as a sport oh okay mm -hmm. she about to reap what she saw and it's not a page of pentacles or a page of cups that bitch about to be the honey that goes to the beehive. Because I said so. I don't even talk to my children like that sometimes. But it ain't often. Because they have sense and they use it. These hoes wasn't raised with sense, divine masculine. That's why y'all left they cheating, thieving asses in the first place. That's why y'all took a time to be like, that motherfucker did not go where they said they was going. Where did they sneak and go off to? A motherfucking practitioner. They went to a practitioner with your creative energy. Because you were made out of the love that your father had. But it was it was an illusion. But it was high vibrational love for him. Type, type, type S. Alright. Yeah changes get used to them so many changes taking place it's about time to be honest with you duh what's that back there in that fire just give me the light i ain't even gonna talk about him look at this bitch up here in this picture and i'm only calling her a bitch because she's sitting there like being sneaky like can he see me if I'm hiding in the corner of this picture? And he over here proposing to probably Divine Feminine. Divine Feminine, not in man hands, in man hands. Yeah, Divine Masculine proposing to Divine Feminine, the karmic females then etch themselves, etch and sketching, but playboard themselves into somebody's fucking picture. Yeah, paint me in this type of environment so I can just, you know, do that ritual and 
lay down and I'll be right there with my man. That's not my man, but that's my man. That's how hoes talk. That's sick, psychotic, and weird as hell. I'm not gonna lie to you. I could never, would never. That is like unfathomable. Yeah, unfathomable. I said it right. Oh, bejeebers. I know that's crazy how my rising ascent is cool waters, but fire at the same time. That's what they get for playing on my birth wheel. That's what hoes get for not trying to tap into, but shred and tear my Akashic records up. We can't change it. Oh no, this shit gotta go. You need to burn this. It won't burn. Cut it up. It won't rip. No. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No, I can't see that happen.